Hey guys, it's Codextral again, back with another tutorial for the Envision Power Board. So, right now we're currently logged in, we're viewing the, um, after the installation. So just a couple of things, um, most of the users here are going to create like a new topic, so, I mean, it could be the title of anything, and this is where they're going to post their content and submit a topic, so to me this doesn't really matter. Um, and it does a whole bunch of other stuff. Uh, you can go to your profile, you can upload an avatar, things are a little bit more social so you can visit other people's um, profile, although that you won't see their email because that's set on private unless if you show otherwise. So if another user was um, came on here and it uh, shows uh, the recent profile visitor and you guys can exchange comments back and forth you can also have a cover photo here and it shows all the activity uh, the posts that you made and the comments that you're going to be making you can go to your calendar uh, let's go to the calendar uh, do, 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 do. somewhere just gotta find it but in the calendar you can post events and oh there it is so you can uh, create events and uh, tomorrow we're going to be doing like a pizza party um, pizza but yeah you get the gist of the idea and other people can create events as well and other people can keep up to date of what's going on so it's just an all um this is a forums and again it's just a, uh, a social media board so right now we're into the administration uh, control panel you want to click on the drop down menu and click on uh, admin CP then this is where you can see who's registered you can modify their user um, if they have like a, a bad word in their username or some sort like that you can change that you can also change the password and view other private information uh, such as their email their IP address and we'll go ahead and continue on so within the uh, community here this is where we're going to create some stuff. Uh, so we'll say create new, and this will be our home. Um, and this will be the category. And you're going to go ahead and click on save. And this is where you'll give permission to who wants to view it. So if you don't want guests to view it or members or moderators, so on and so forth, you can just uh, uncheck mark that. Go ahead and click on save, but we'll leave it checked marked. This is where you want to get creative and how you want to do things. We're going to create a form here. And introduction. And you want that as discussion so people are able to actually post in there. And the parent form that's what we just created so it's going to be categorized under that it's going to be uh, branched off under this tree if you want it to be password protected you can have it be password protected but um, we're not going to worry about that and no password required so you can give certain groups uh, access to that if they don't know the password and there's a whole description that can go on into other details and we're just going to skim through this here so we can show you how to create a forum and this is where okay they can see the uh, the introduction forum that we made and they can reply to it create new t comments uh, new topics uh, download any attachments uh, you can even set that with guests I don't recommend this but you can definitely have it to uh, read topics and show the forums and so on and so forth We'll go ahead and click on save and now we're going to go ahead and refresh and right here so this is the example where they uh, had it set up and this is what we set up and let's um, set up another thing here I'm going to go ahead and create new we're going to have another category and uh, so discussions questions uh, redirects 
if you want them to go to like another website like facebook.com or what have you and we're just going to do announcements and nope just uh, category and no parents uh, unless if you want it to be under um, home then it'll be treed or branched under that tree into another tree if that made sense so while this saves we're gonna go ahead and just give the users permission to view and we're gonna create another form here and it's gonna be a discussion forum so people are able to talk about things um, so we had it under announcements uh, I guess official topics about whatever uh, and it's going to be um, under the parent forum and we'll just go ahead and click on save and now when we refresh it it will have another category added let's go ahead and refresh it one more time oh yep okay that's why we have to do one last step now it'll pop up Alrighty, so we can go ahead and just introduce ourselves. I'll be the first to create a topic. And hello, world. How are you? And I don't care if I misspelled it. And submit a topic. And this is where, you know, people can start talking to each other. And for official topics. Um, like if you have like an official announcement or something like that, this is where you're going to get creative. Uh, official announcement, something, something. And <laughs> this is an announcement, something, something, something. Okay, and this is where, you know, you make your official announcement, like, hey, you know, we're throwing this big old bash pizza party, give Codexual some free pizza, and you'll just go ahead and create that new topic. Um, so that's, that's the basic gist of what this really is, is where you're going to categorize everything here. And the fun thing is we're going to start messing around with widgets and uh, customize the feel to this and as well with the theme. Uh, we're going to get into that a little bit later into the next video. But I just wanted to show you the basic functionality of what we could do here. And there's other things that we can modify as well. But this is just the basic parts of everything. So um, we're going to go ahead and stop right here. We're going to move on to the next video. If you guys find this very informative for the new users uh, that are watching this video, please, 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 please give me a thumbs up. Uh, subscribe to my videos and also give me... Um, a thumbs up I think I've already mentioned that if you can also register at nalog.com and also join our discord we definitely need some new users and meet new people and we're very friendly so yeah show your support to me I give my support back to you guys and see you into the next video where we're gonna be doing the um, widgets and we're gonna be doing with more add-ons and whatnot alrighty guys see you in the next video